We begin the artwork of this image with processing the file in Adobe Camera Raw. The goal is to create a foundation of moody, sensual lighting for this image. To achieve that, we'll make three practical lighting passes on this image, following the basics of lighting in Photoshop, which are shadows, midtones, and highlights. Each of these lighting passes will be opened as smart objects, so we can return to ACR to adjust their values as needed. We'll combine each lighting pass with layer masks. Next, we move into retouching and frequency separation. With this powerful retouching tool, we'll separate the details of the image from the color so we can truly have control over all aspects of the image. If you are not familiar with frequency separation or would like to learn how to use it, a full guide plus a free Photoshop action will be linked in the description below. Dodging and burning is one of my favorite techniques in Photoshop. You can augment the sense of three dimensions in the image and help add to the moody lighting of this scene.
And now we come to the teaching moment of this speed art. So let's slow down the footage and discuss. I want to remove the wreath from the wall and my first choice is to use content aware fill. I'll use the lasso tool to make a selection around the wreath and see if Skynet can get the job done, although I don't have high hopes. As I suspected, there are just too many lines in the bricks that need to match up for Adobe Sensei to do an accurate job. So we'll have to resort to the clone stamp tool and a bit of patience as we borrow material from either side of the wreath to lay a new foundation. Don't worry about the colors and the lighting not matching. We'll repair those in a moment with a return to frequency separation. Now I'll use Liquify to push the pixels around to straighten out the lines. I can use this option because of the shallow depth of field in this image, which created the out-of-focus wall behind our subject. The bottom line and the lesson learned is that it is far infinitely easier and more efficient to simply take the wreath off the wall during the photography session. After 20 plus years of being a professional photographer, I'm still learning. Frequency separation is a very powerful technique in Photoshop. Its use goes way beyond cleaning up the skin of a human subject. Visit the retouching series on this channel to learn how to use frequency separation and many other powerful tools in Photoshop. And now it's time for the color grade and to finish the journey of art with this image. I'm using the Reimagined plugin to lay out a foundation I can work with, following the three core elements to all digital photo editing, color, luminosity, and detail. You can purchase the Reimagined plugin by visiting my website, link in the description below. And with some finishing touches, this artwork is now complete. If you like the content that you found in this video, then please give the video a like and consider subscribing to the channel. New content debuts each week in photography and Photoshop education. 
And when you subscribe, make sure to hit the bell icon so you'll be notified of that new content when you return to the YouTubes. Thanks for watching today, and until next time, I'll see you out there in the world of Photoshop.